Good morning. And may God bless you. I wanted to say, hey, God is amazing. And um, he does things that are just, it's, it's off. It's, it's him. You know, it's God. It's God. You know, it's God. And I just want to say, I love the Lord. I thank him for the trials. I thank him for the tribulations. And I want to encourage you today, this hour. First of all, I want to say I'm sorry for not being diligent and 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 and, and, and obedient to my call. Um, I just been in this um, season of building faith. You know, it's just me and him. It was me and Daddy, and um, he always comes out on top. He always does. He's a he's a he's a he's Alpha, and he's Omega. He's Alpha and Omega. Alpha and Omega. The beginning and the end and what he does hang on i'm riding my bike is he he takes care of us when we we think that everything's going to fall around all around us everybody's left us there's nobody there's nobody there's nobody and there he is there he is and he says ye of little faith and I just want to say, praise God for everything that he's doing, everything that he's doing, everything. He has given me hope. He's given me life. He's given me, he's given me a, a, a new perspective on life. And that is people are in pain and they need a savior. They need a savior. They really do. Just like me, I needed a savior. And he came through. He came through. You know, the word of God says, don't grow weary in well-doing, for you will be richly, richly rewarded. And um, knowing that he, he's the author and the finisher of our faith. But I'm going to tell you this. Beware of the enemy. Beware of the enemy. When he says he comes in sheep's clothing, let me remind you that he does. And that sheep clothing, it could be your family. It could be your friend. It could be your girlfriend. It could be your man. It could be anything. If they are not in tune with God, he will use them. And he will use them to try to distract us. And that's the thing that is so crucial, so crucial in this walk with the Lord. I want to remind you that it is time to buckle down. It is time to prepare yourself for promotion. Hey man, promotion, promotion. What that looks like to you it could be anything. It could be currency. It could be spiritually. It could be emotionally. It could be physically. Whatever that is. I remind you. Prepare yourself. Because the enemy is not going down without a fight. And I must remind you. This war is not done. This fight is not done. Until you hear my well done, well done, well done, my good and faithful servant. Today, 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 you enter with me into paradise. You know, that is a beautiful saying, amen. I want to just say, don't grow weary because he will open doors for you when you didn't even think. You might forgot, but he didn't. It is about... It's about the gift. It's about the purpose. It's about the relationship. It's about what God has. He has in store. He's not going to give you something that you're not prepared for. He's not. He's not. He's not. And he may. And it may spank you. It may hurt you. It may harm you. But he's there to remind you you're not ready. 
like he did to me. You're not ready, Sean. You're not ready. But I didn't give up. I didn't give up. Now I'm about to move into my place today. I'm about to move in my place today. And some people want to think that they did it, but they didn't do it. Daddy did it. Daddy did it. The father did it. And he did it because he loved me. He loves me. Not because I'm obedient. Not because I'm obedient. Because that is far-fetched. There's no way in the world. I'm not. Oh, I had attitude. Oh, I had attitude. I relapsed. I had attitude, I gave up, I wanted to kill myself, I wanted to jump off the bridge, I wanted to just give up, because it was hard, it was hard, it was hard, it was hard, but praise be to God, you know, there's a saying I love, but God, but God, and then the other one, suddenly, ha <laughs> ha, glory, suddenly, 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 and I just declare today over your life the suddenlies. I declare over your life the but God because we are about to come into a place of intimacy like we've never seen before. Our hearts have to to be ready our minds have to be ready our bodies have to be ready we our spirit our soul must line up and be ready because what God has right now and what he's about to bring on his people is about to shock the world the world is about to get shocked in a place that they have never seen before. And the thing is, you got to be ready. You have to be ready. You have to be ready. You have to be ready. Because my brothers and my sisters, if you're not, then it may hurt. Because the enemy's gonna be there too. He's gonna be along their way and he's gonna try to do what he can to knock you down, 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 and off, and try to kill you, and I'm telling you right now, be careful, be wise, be wise, 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 you have to be wise, wise, because if you're not wise, if you're not diligent in that word, if you're not in relationship with the king of kings, if you're not, you will be. You will be broken off. I'm not lying. You will be broken off. You will be broken off. And that, that can hurt. It can hurt because that can put you in a place where you're by yourself. That can put you in a place where you are being attacked by the ones who you love, that can put you in a place where if you're not strong, you can chalk it up. If you're not strong, you can chalk it up because it's going to hurt. It's going to hurt bad. It's going to hurt bad. It's going to hurt bad. And I want to remind you that blessings are about to come. Favor is about to come. But are you ready? Yeri ala sundo di ala andi di di ala sundo loro di ala andi di ala sundo di ala andi di ala nae. Yeri ala sundo loro di ala yeri ala. Yeri ala sundo di ala sundo di ala sundo loro. 
Yeri ala sundo, riri ala sundo, riala yeri ala sundai. Yeri ala sundo, yeri ala sundo, riala yeri ala sundai. Yes, I sing praises to the one who gave it all for me. I will sing praises to you, oh God, I know that you are there for me. I will sing praises to you, all eternity. I will sing Hold me to the land I'll sing Hold me to the land For he's worthy, worthy of praise Yes, he is I sing Hold to the Lamb, I sing holy to the King, for He's worthy, so worthy yes, of my praise. I sing holy, I sing Oh, oh, I sing holy to the one who gave it all for me. Hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. Father, I thank you for this day, O oh God. I thank you for your grace. Thank you for your mercy and thank you for your mercy for you are rich. Lord, you are good. You are good. You're good. You're more than able to do exceedingly, abundantly above all that we could ever think or ask of, oh God. Father, I just ask right now in Jesus' name that those ears that are listening right now, I pray, Father, that they would be prepared. They'd be prepared. Prepared for the gifts. Prepare for your favor. Prepare for your blessings. Prepare, oh God. That praise would come even in the waiting. Even in the waiting period, God. For the waiting period is the development. The waiting period is the development. The waiting period is the place where you begin to grow. The waiting period is the place where you're fed. The waiting period is the place, oh God, where maturity, maturity takes its course. Hallelujah, Lord. Father, thank you for your for your loving and loving, loving love. Thank you for your love, oh God. Thank you for your love, God. Thank you for your love, God. Declare, God. I declare, God. I declare, God. Father, right now, in the name of Jesus, I declare, I declare, I declare, Father. I declare, Father, right now, in Jesus' name. I declare wholeness restoration of families restorations oh god of hearts that are broken god i declare father right now in the name of jesus lord financial prosperity god lord i declare father right now in the name of jesus the desires of the heart of these ones oh god that are looking for what you have for them they want they need oh god bless them oh god bless them strengthen them Give them, oh God, everything, everything, oh God. Yeri ala sundo lo lo di ala yandi di ala sundo lo di ala yandi di ala sunda. Yeri ala sundo lo lo di ala yandi di ala sunda. Thank you, Father. I want to say this right now. Those who are struggling in their lives and they know that they want to give. You know that train means? That train means Jesus. God is saying he loves me. He loves me. So I want to say this to you. I'm passing this. This is a gift to you. I'm passing it on to you. When you hear that train, you'll hear daddy say, I love you. 
But I want to say right now that I know it's been a struggle in your life. I know it's been hard. I know it has. I know it has. I know it has. I know it has. And I want to say that the Father's arms are open wide. He loves you so much. He cares about you so much that He gave His Son, Jesus Christ, that you would have eternal life. He says that whosoever believeth on Him, whoever believeth on Him, shall not perish but have everlasting life. For God so loved the world. So He didn't come to condemn, but He came to save. So those who are listening to my voice want to give their life to Jesus. I want to encourage you to repeat after me. And those who have been dealing with things in their life, their addictions, their, their whatever it is, I don't need to know. All I know is this. Daddy wants to take care of it and set you free. If you want to rededicate your life to Jesus, I want to say, repeat after me. Father, thank you for this day. Thank you for your grace and your mercy. I haven't lived the life that I like. I'm, I want to give up. I'm done. But I want to give you a chance. 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 I want you to take my life and do as you please. Make my life. Make my life into that life that will bring forth glory that will give you honor and that will give you praise. Thank you for all that you have done. Thank you for all that you're doing. I pray right now that you would forgive me of all my sins and that you would come into my heart and be my Lord and personal Savior. From this moment on, I serve you. I will serve you with all my heart with all my mind, with all my body, with all my soul, with all my strength. This day is a brand new day for me. Today I'm set free. Today I'm free. Today I'm set free. Today I'm a brand new creation. I'm a brand new creature. Everything's past. I have become new. I will not, I will not look back. For I have been given another chance. I am free. I am saved. And right now, I'm happy. So Father, thank you for giving Jesus. Because your word says, those who confess with their mouth and believe in their heart are saved. And I believe in my heart. I believe unto righteousness. I am saved. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Jesus, for giving me Another chance through your blood. Thank you. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. Hallelujah. Welcome to the family. Welcome to the family. Those who gave their life to Jesus, I am so proud of you. You are a part of a family that only, only bought by the blood. <laughs> Oh, what a glorious day. I really appreciate you guys being with me today. I know it's a little different. I've been riding my bike and I know it's been a little different, but you know what? Hey, God says be ready in season and out. And I just want to say bless the Lord, oh my soul. Bless the Lord. Bless the Lord. Bless the Lord. Thank you for being here with me. I just wanted to tell you that I'm proud of you. Stay strong. Don't ever let the enemy, don't let the enemy get in the way. Don't let him take anything from you. Because you know what? Greater is he that's in you than he that's in the world. Until next time, God bless you. Have a wonderful day. And know this, if God before you, who can be against you? Take care now.